This just in, another Blackpool resident was reported missing today in a case that continues to baffle local authorities. You should not have returned. It's not safe for you here. My soul is now free, but I fear that you are in great danger. Because you've done so much to help me and the others, we now promise to follow and assist you. Unfortunately, altering the appearance of objects in the world of the living is the only way for us to offer physical support. If you must stay here, use my locket as your guide to find the changing objects. See if you can locate the changing object on the automobile. Well done, detective! Now, find the changing objects outside the gate, so that we may assist you in your investigation. We wish you luck, but be mindful of the perils that await you. Warnings, Detective. Turn back while you still can.
please, do not enter these forsaken grounds. Please, detective, abandon your pursuit before you're harmed.
Looks like you've dug your own grave, Detective. Father will be so very pleased. We should not have returned to this place. We need to get out of here at once. Welcome back, Detective. I can't wait to show you what I've been working on. After you destroyed my home and family, my good son Victor took it upon himself to travel back in time and begin work on my greatest creation. With the souls of my loved ones forever out of reach, I needed you to lure them back home. I knew you couldn't resist returning to torment me. Time and again, you've misunderstood my intentions. That's why I built this prison for you. So that you may better understand. Before you die, I want you to know what it's like to be me.
You can scarcely imagine it, Detective. Healing someone, only to be to pluck the final petal from their once lovely bloom. I want you to know what it feels like to give and take life. My pretty maids, all in a row. Touch their bellies, make them grow. Pump them up, all nice and neat. 
Earn yourself a delicious treat. Isn't she lovely, detective? The miracle of birth is something I want you to experience. If you wish to live, you must first give life to me.
This is where I was taught my place in life. This is where I learned pain and fear. How could you understand without knowing how that feels?
Be careful! Stop it! What are you doing?
stop it. You enjoy this, don't you? So good. Does it feel to grovel at the heels of that vile beast that called itself my mother? Mother! I'm glad you're beginning to understand.
hold at her heart. From her I learned pain. From here I learned madness. <laughs> Until one day I met someone I wasn't supposed to meet. So well. He taught me to escape by embracing the madness. <laughs> Are you ready to embrace the madness, Detective?
getting closer, detective. Do you feel us coming together?
synopsis of patient number 7149, Charles Nathaniel Dalmar. Subject suffers from thought disorders manifested through the belief that he can create locks that bind a person's soul. Curiously, Mr. Dalmar claims to have learned said ability from his father in this institution. This place was made bearable by a man I came to know as my father. He taught me to channel my hatred into creating locks that keep others from causing me pain. Once I had the knowledge to create such devices, no door would ever again confine me. That's when I planned my escape.
coming home again. Coming back to life. <laughs> for the lengthy courtship, but look how we've bonded. Now I can finally give you the gift of our forever home. Come, see what I've built for us, my love.
to life. Detective, we can no longer assist you. Please, save yourself. Escape this place. <laughs> Welcome home, my love. Isn't it wonderful? Just imagine it. Hundreds of souls powering my final creation. A machine that gives life to the dead. My family will finally be united forever with you. It's newest memory. Wait to string you up like the others! Make yourself at home, my dear. Celebrate our eternal reunion. This is the end. <laughs> 